Well, an arson investigation is underway after a home caught fire Monday up in Hopkinsville. A woman we know was sent to the hospital after being saved by the police chief. Our Aaron Kentrell caught up with him to find out how he managed to pull her from that burning home. In my mind, I, I thought if, if this young lady's going to die in the house, I, I'll, I'll be in here with her because there's no way I was just going to leave her. Crime scene tape remains wrapped around this home on the 800 block of East 4th Street after it caught fire. When I got there to the house, there were a couple of people outside and I asked them, I said, did everybody make it out? And they said, no. I said, there's a young lady trapped inside. Without hesitation, Hopkinsville Police Chief Jason Newby went in through the front door. He says the smoke was quickly filling his lungs. I crawled through the living room, got about to the hallway. It looked like a hallway. It was just really thick smoke, but I could see the flames uh, and I knew I couldn't go that way. Eventually making it back out, finding another way to rescue the woman. I went up to the window and asked her, I said, can you finish? Can you crawl out? She said, no, she said, I can't. So I, I reached in through the window and was grabbed her and was able to pull and tug enough until I finally got her over the, the sill and uh, pulled her out. Of course, smoke's barreling out the window on us the whole time and uh, got her out and drug her to the front yard out of the smoke and, and EMS got there right about that time. Chief Newby may be a police officer, but says they have the same mission as a firefighter. Serving and protecting the community and we are one team. Fire officials say the fire was suspicious after finding evidence it was intentionally set. Now Chief Newby's department is stepping in to take over the arson investigation. He's just thankful no lives were lost. You may not always be able to make the difference that you want, uh, but when you have days like that, when you when you make a huge difference in somebody's life like that, it, it makes this career choice worth it. In Hopkinsville, Aaron Cantrell, News Channel 5. Great job. The woman's expected to be okay. Investigators say the home did not have working smoke detectors.